everybody, what's going on? We are back with some Launcher of Realms. Uh, we are continuing to kind of focus on our faction trial improvements. Uh, I think now we can get through this wave in Tide as well. So we're actually going to give this a go, see if they can get through it. We have officially unlocked the other page of talents now, so we've been upgrading those here and there as, as we're able. Um, so I guess we'll just let it go and see see how the fight goes. I assume we'll be okay now because it seemed like a like a BP check, like very much like a BP check up to this point. So I anticipate us getting through this one now. But progression seems like it's going to be quite a bit slower now because every stage seems to be kind of a significant jump. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Looking like we're holding pretty well, though. Yeah, I think we're good. All that shoving. Looking like a Black Friday sale, dude. I'm so ready. I'm so ready to do some summons. I really, really am, am hoping we can we can break our streak with uh, with these summons when they go live. I'm I'm really ready, dude. All right, yeah. See, it's it's a big jump every stage now, but you know the rewards are dope. One thirty-five, one forty. Have we gotten another? No. Our next Volca soul is at one forty, which is probably going to be several weeks. Honestly, again, progress is is very slow now. I also don't really know what I think the best talents are in here i've been kind of focusing on my mages and, and archers but i don't i don't really know if i know which one i think i probably need my tanks to be able to my tanks and fighters probably need to be able to hold up as well is this hp or is this healing yeah that's hp i probably need fighters A oh, ground unit. Okay, yeah. Ground unit is probably a good one because it's covering more than one, covering more than one base. Let's let's do one for that. I mean, it's one percent. It's not like it's a huge deal yet, but it'll it'll get there. So, all right, that's cool. That's cool. We have a new dragon pass live. I was scrolling through it. I don't think there's anything out of the ordinary in this one, right? It's it's just a standard. I know they put the hat suit skin in the last one, which we got. So if we ever pull our great, <laughs> but um, I don't think there's anything that stands out in this one. It's just, which again, it's, it's still good value, but like nothing super exciting about it. So there's that. We have this live for, I feel, I feel like they, Maybe I'm wrong, but I feel like I've only ever seen this for Gear Raid 3. Which is frustrating, because it's the only one... It's the only Gear Raid that I'm still stuck on 18. So I just feel like it's not really as... worth it to do it at 18. Like, it would be much more worth it in the higher stages. So I'm not as excited about it. I, I, I acknowledge that it's a great event, but like... I don't want to do it at stage 18, so I don't know. Maybe we can make some progress there. Maybe we can, maybe we can, I don't know much about Gear Raid 319. I don't know if I've ever even tried it, to be honest. Like, I think the map is totally different, right? Yeah, I don't even think I've tried this yet. So we're just like much more limited. Wow. Yeah, that's going to be interesting. I was thinking it's going to be hard enough just having the one, but the fact that there's three. 
Like, like who, who goes here? Even. I don't know. Yeah, a lot of the popular, a lot of the usual suspects. Oh, maybe, maybe I'll mess around with that some today also. I do want to look at here though, because we're only on stage six in here and I feel like we should be able to get a little further. So we probably need to look at building a couple of these champs. But the question is, is who of them do I care to build? You know, I don't know much about any of them. I guess we need to give them a look in our, in our roster. Let's do that. This one, right? I think I heard we're going to start being able to bring him in to faction trials. I'm not entirely sure about that, but I feel like I heard that recently. We've got Laurel. So we've got Ardith, who is our only tank in the faction right now. We've got him. He's double faction. Seeing if any of these names jump out at, at me at some I've heard before. I think I rem remember thinking Cyclone seemed pretty interesting. I probably don't need a lot of platform. I think I need I think I need units on the ground and I think I need some support, which I don't seem to have a support at all in this in this um faction which is tough. Really? What's what's the rest of the faction look like? I don't have a support. There is no epic support. What a weird decision. What a weird thing to do. Never seen this jam before in my life. So there's three supports in the faction, and they're all legendary. That's not great. I don't love that. So that I guess that's why we're struggling in here. Because you would think with Comet, we would be okay. So let's do a run real quick and see where it really feels like the hole is. And then maybe we'll try to build somebody to fill the hole specifically. Maybe that's a good way to go here. And hopefully the hole isn't obviously um, a heel. <laughs> now I probably want to have him in a situation where he can hit both. Um, And then I think I probably want to have her here. I didn't even look at the stipulations to three star this stage. Can I see it from here? I don't think I can. My combat is a lot stronger now. Then the last time I tried this, maybe he will be able to just do it. I'm probably going to have to build this dude. Maybe even just a five star. I think I just need someone to kind of hold, hold him up for a second. I could get someone over here for some damage as well.
Physical battle for the ages going on there, huh? <laughs> yeah, he Comet might be okay to just clear this now. I think before near the end, some enemies would slip through. But I kind of think he's going to be strong enough now to not let that happen, so. Especially if I ult. Okay, we're definitely in the clear. So maybe if it's like a matter of like, place this many mages or, or something, we'll just throw a bunch of champs down. You need to stop, you little bastard. Okay. Yeah, see, deploy mage is a dumb. It's a dumb stipulation. Just give me three stars if I clear it and don't take damage. Okay, so stage seven, clear with all heroes alive. Clear the stage with the soul core intact. Okay, all heroes alive, so no one can die. So then we might just place Comet and, and AI and see how that goes. I think probably this way. Oh, we got we got a little bit of a problem here. He might need to come down or he might need to move up actually. We'll see. That gives him two squares to take care of whoever comes through there, so maybe it's okay. And if we do this. Now, anybody else we place can't die. And I th I think if I pick them up, they don't count as dying, but still. Dude, nobody's really going to help here anyway, so we might as well just see if he can do it. You piece of shit. Okay, maybe we have to swap him. Because he's just going to get to stand there and hit us for a while. We'll see if he's able to do enough damage to like be a problem. But Hurry it up. Hurry it up. Maybe not. Maybe he's not going to be able to do enough damage. They seem to be sucking his ult away, which is kind of annoying. But still, I think he's going to be okay. Between her slowing stuff down and him... If we can get him killed and get an ult, it'd be great. Okay, so this is it. Final, final push. Nice. Alright, what's next? Deploy at least six heroes, clear with it intact, and clear it so they can die, so that's fine.
Maybe we do... Let's try the same method again. Let's try it the same way. And see how much damage they do. And if they're going to be a problem, we'll have to rearrange a little bit. But let's see. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if any of these other champs have any, any gear on them even. Okay. Are you going after him? Just somebody there to tank hits, you know? You're going to slip through, aren't you? Oh, so close. Come on, come on, come on. All right, nice. Now kill these two guys. And then now, I think what we probably should do is this. Come on, come out. Get that ult. Get that ult, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go, baby. All right. Pretty good progress there, I think. So, okay. And I don't know if we're even ready to farm this anyway. What do we get from here? gold ones <clears throat> actually yeah we could we could keep moving up there if we wanted to Well, there you go. That's pretty good. We'll take we'll take that progress. Moved up in Tide. Moved up in Faction Trials. So we will take it, dude. We'll take it. We we won the uh, Vault in the Sands, so we got bonus ten frags from there, uh, which puts us at like what fifty five or something fifty. So we're getting close to our first copy, and then again, I, I think we can probably pretty easily get a second copy. And we'll have an A3 Vladov. So that'll be cool. What's he get at A3 again? Here he gets crit rate. Here he gets... Yeah, some like self-sustain. So pretty cool. You know what I mean? Pretty cool. I'm, I'm fine with that. So I reckon we'll wrap it up here for today. Maybe I'm going to put mess around in Gear Raid 3 today. And then when the... Um, when the summons go live, dude, it's on. We've got 72. We've been accumulating summons like crazy lately. Uh, they've, they've, all the events and stuff that have been going on, we've, we've been piling them up. We haven't bought any, aside from the ones we get from that daily pack. You know what I mean? The one that gives you this one. Um, but other than that, like we've just been collecting them from everything going on. So I think we have more than enough to hit pity. Should be guaranteed at least one, but one, one one plus one and then maybe we'll pull some other legendaries aside from that but because i i think we're kind of do a crazy session too i don't want to keep getting into pity i want to 
I want to have one of those crazy sessions where you pull more than you think you're going to pull. So we'll see how it goes, but it's coming soon. I'm pretty stoked about it. I hope you guys are, are ready for it. And uh, other than that, um, I'm getting out of here. I'll see you later.